What is up everybody? Video Addict here and I've got an envelope and I'm pretty excited. So it's that time of year again. Uh, I don't think y'all ever enjoy this video because I have so many fans that are not from Texas, I guess you say. So uh, we'll just get right into this. Uh, it's like one of my happiest times of the year. I'm not going to lie to you. All right. This is my 2018-2019 season Dallas Cowboys season tickets. Yeah. Oh my goodness. Uh, it feels like they skimped out on me a little bit this year. It doesn't feel as like bulky as it normally does. So... Uh, normally there's all kinds of information in this thing. It doesn't seem like there's all that much in here, but we're gonna get into it. It may go fast, but we, I, I just felt I needed to share it with y'all. All right. We got a nice little envelope here. 2018 season tickets. Celebrating 10 seasons at AT&T Stadium. And if you've never been to that stadium, I know a lot of people are just like, they, they don't even care about the Cowboys. They just go because that stadium is unbelievable. We're excited to have you join us for another great year of Dallas Cowboys football at AT&T Stadium. Enclosed are your 2018 Dallas Cowboys season tickets and parking if applicable. It's not because I'm not paying that much for parking. In addition to the enclosed tickets, you will find the following. 2018 Dallas Cowboys season ticket holder sticker, um, 2018 game day program vouchers, uh, club season ticket holders only, that's not me either, uh, star sports tours, away game information, information from several of the Dallas Cowboys corporate partners. Please note your 2018 discount card will be mobile this year. Please see the insert for further information. Okay. Again, they've included the Playoff tickets in case we make it. That way they don't have to mail you out something else. They just become active once you've made the playoffs. Uh, this has not gone well for us recently. As always, thank you for your continued support of the Dallas Cowboys. We look forward to an outstanding season at at and Stadium. Sincerely, Dallas Cowboys Football Club. Got our first little envelope here. Season ticket holder information. Uh, I got a... Sticker, 2018 season ticket holder. I may put that on my truck. Where's my discount card? Tells you how to get your discount card. The Ring of Honor Kitchen and Bar. Now, they have this thing that you can like pay and then you're like all included. Like you can go there and eat before the games and everything, drink, eat, whatever you want to do at this little kitchen and bar. But it's like very expensive. And it's per person, so you'd have to pay twice to have for your two tickets, or else I would have to go in by myself, and then they would have to just sit outside. Very, very nice place. Uh, cool idea. Get the app, AT and T app, I guess. AT and T thanks. Exclusive benefits at your fingertips. The only way to kick off a home game: player and cheerleader meet and greet. Autograph sessions with current Dallas Cowboys. Uh, photos of Dallas Cowboys cheerleaders. Q&A with Brian Brodus and Mickey Spagnola. And prize giveaway, food buffet, and more. The day before every Cowboys home game, visit CowboysTravel.com or call blah, blah, blah for Star Sports Tours. Star Sports Tours, uh, they tend to be pretty pricey too. Uh, but they do, let, they do have like a meet and greet with the players. Um, so that's actually kind of, kind of a cool little deal a lot of people are texting me this time of night i do not know uh reliant energy get a hundred dollar gift card but i don't live in texas so therefore unfortunately so therefore that doesn't apply to me 
Uh, Tommy John, proud sponsor of your boys. Uh, Tommy John underwear, I guess. There's a dude. 20% off your first order. UPS. Just whatever. Alright, didn't get a magnetic schedule. I'm pretty upset about that. That sucks. This here is my season ticket. <laughs> that just sucks. So yeah, as always, they're very, very shiny and they look beautiful and I'm so excited. Uh, these are both the exact same thing. They're just, uh, it's either, you know, seat one or seat two. So anyway, basically, I'll just kind of look at this one and tell you who they are. Starting over here, this is Jeff Heath, Lel Collins, Sean Lee, uh, Dang it. Tyron Smith, Dak Prescott, Travis Frederick, uh, Demarcus Lawrence, uh, Ezekiel Elliott, Jalen Smith, uh, Tyrone Crawford, Cole Beasley, and Zach Martin. Uh, this is the year of the freaking linemen, I guess. Offense and defense. Uh, looks like we got a lot of linemen in the in the photos. Uh, I, I, it hurts my heart to not see a ticket with Jason Witten on it. And it just, it hurts, man. It really does. Uh, I will continue to wear the Jason Witten jersey until someone proves himself to be somebody uh, like him, to be a leader like him. So uh, I'm not going to wear a Cole Beasley jersey. He's the only other one that I would you know, considered to be a strong leader. You know, the line, they're all good guys, but uh, nobody wants to wear the lineman jersey. Not really. <laughs> I mean, sometimes you do. I mean, I love the lineman. Don't get me wrong. I do. I talked to Zach Martin on the phone one day. It was crazy. Uh, he's crazy. He, he was very upset with me because I told him that I liked Frederick because I was a center in college and high school and uh, arena football. So, I love the center position, so I'm a fan of Frederick, and I just don't like the number 72. Uh, I'm not a big fan of Tyron Smith, and I think that he's getting a little injured, but I love that number, 77. That was my high school number, my college number, and my arena football number. So if I just think that Tyron Smith's getting a little bit aged, so until he either picks his stuff up or uh, somebody else comes in with that number, I, I probably won't wear that number, but I do love that number. I'd wear that jersey. Um, but Zach Martin, he's a cool cat. He was a little offended. He said, I went to Notre Dame, you know? And I was like, because ah, I was talking about how smart centers were. He's like, dude, I went to Notre Dame. I'm like, I still like centers. <laughs> uh, Ezekiel Elliott, man, I'm, I'm super excited for him and Dak to have a full season. Uh, and put their stuff together. But, um, yeah, that's it. I'm super excited. Um, you know, you get these paper tickets. I don't ever use them. I just put them in the drawer down there because everything's electronic now. They send you the paper tickets, I think, just for nostalgia purposes. But, uh, you know, now everything's done with your phone. You just go up there, you, they scan your phone, and you walk in the door. So, anyway, very, very, very cool. Very excited for the season to see what's going to happen. I, for one, am not feeling super confident. Uh, I just feel like we, unless some stuff happens, and that's, this happens all the time, I don't know the ins and outs of everything that they're doing. I don't sit here and watch the news sites on the Cowboys every <clears throat> every year, you know, and to know all the moves that they're making. But right now, I feel like we don't have a downfield threat. Uh, we just lost our freaking go-to guy, Jason Witten. Uh, a lot of unknown people that, you know, they say are good. Uh, I didn't think we had a great draft, so I mean, I, I don't know. Uh, you know, they they sit here and they, they grade your draft. I think we got graded like a B or something, and it's just like I don't. I've never heard of any of those people 
But then again, I don't watch college football as much as I used to, so I don't really hear about it all. So it is what it is, right? Anyway, that's it. That's all I got for you. Tell me what you liked. Tell me what you didn't, which I'm sure there's going to be a lot of it. Uh, in the comments below, like, share, comment, all that fun stuff. And, of course, subscribe. I'm out. So we're looking at my fifth season as a season ticket holder. <laughs> there they are. Five seasons. And I'm not going to lie to you. There's probably going to be many more.